looking back to the final last year, it just didn't work out for us on the day. You know, we probably felt we were in a strong position to get into the final after a good semi-final victory against Roscommon. Um, but again, the, the early start that Mayo got us on that, on that they caught us off off guard, and uh, you know they probably obviously they won comfortably in the end. But it's something that you'd like to get back and, and have another crack at again. But we know that so we have a formidable task ahead of us to to get there again. Um, to get over, we have to get over our semi final first. Overall, the the Connacht Championship is going to be very competitive this year. Sligo are good. Uh, Galway, Mayo. Um, there's there's some very strong uh, teams and some very good players in in the province. Uh, like Galway have been uh, improving steadily over the last two two years, and we're probably very unlucky to um, not get promotion to Division One this year. Um, Sligo bet us in the championship last year, um, so it, I think there'll be some some great games this year, and uh, hopefully it'll be competitive. But uh, I suppose it's up to the rest of us. To, Mayo have been very strong over the last couple of years. They've been last five six years without a doubt the best team in in Connacht, one of the best teams in the country. Um, so it's up to the rest of us to try and catch up with them. You know, in any team that you'd, you'd play in Connacht, it's going to be a tough game. I think just the local rivalry of of a provincial game brings its own. I suppose ups and downs and, and uh, the, the, the tasks with that so I suppose it's great to be there semi-final the way the draw worked out for ourselves we're looking forward so we want to make sure our own performance is right on the day if it's right you know we, we won't be far off from probably winning the game We've been very good in the league over the last four or five years we've gone from four to three to two to one uh, but ultimately we haven't brought that into the summer games um, for for different reasons, so we're just going to have to hone in on that and and putting in some good championship performances, and look at provincial titles can come after that, but we've to we've to start uh, putting in some solid performances in championship first. We've only won three in our history, which is disappointing. Um, I've been I've been involved now fifteen sixteen years. I played in five Connacht finals. I've lost four and won one. So it's a, it's a disappointing stat for myself and a disappointing stat for the county in general. Now we've 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 played in in many finals, um, probably not as many as we we should have. And uh, I think the more finals you get to, you've a you have a good chance of winning one. So uh, I look back and kind of a good man in, for my stats and look back on many provincial finals. And I suppose the, the majority of, of of finals have been won between Galway and Mayo, but because they've been in the final so many times and they've kind of. They've swapped them over and back between each other all the time. So I think for Sligo, we have to get to finals. And if you're, if you're there, you have a real chance. So um, that's our ambition, I think, as a county going forward.